Well, every month you can guarantee that there's a new trend on TikTok, whether it's some cool new dance that the kids are all <laughs> doing or some secret menu at insert whatever food establishment. Very true. The latest one involves the diabetic medication Ozempic, a drug that thousands of people, even celebrities like Elon Musk, have praised for helping them lose weight. But Ozempic was originally designed to help treat type 2 diabetes, and unfortunately for those patients who rely on it to help control their blood, shrug, blood sugar, well, they're struggling to just find it at their local pharmacy and the shortages affecting those here in Lubbock too. Kelby Case Jaxie Pigeon talked with some experts about it for us. Jaxie. Well, when the weight loss version of the drug ran low, many prescribers turned to the diabetes version, which is just a lower dose of the same exact medication. That in turn led those with diabetes to struggle filling their prescription for a drug they had to take regularly. Because Ozempic and Wegovy work so well, we are seeing so many testimonials everywhere. People are starting to ask for it. A social media trend for weight loss has in turn led to a shortage of a diabetes medication nationwide. Ozempic was first prescribed for people with type 2 diabetes, and what we found with that was that they were losing a lot of weight. And so as the FDA looked a little bit more into it, they actually approved a drug called Wegovy, which is the same thing as Ozempic, just in a higher dose for weight loss. While Ozempic and Wegovy have the same active ingredient called semaglutide, Texas Tech Nutritional Sciences professor Dr. Martin Binks says they are not interchangeable. Some of the comments I saw from some of the celebrities were a little bit more about achieving appearance goals or just looking like you're in better shape. And you know that, that's not the right message. I, I think that for many of these medicines, they, they're intended for people to make up for something that their body's not doing. The rise in popularity for weight loss outcomes led to a surge of prescriptions, leaving many people patients without the life-saving drug. This medication is get, being prescribed for people who don't necessarily meet the diagnostic criteria. And we can get away with that when people are paying out of pocket. And so now we have a shortage for those persons who were using it for type 2 diabetes. And that's where our concern really lies. Dr. Binks says the drug shortage is a major concern. The emotional toll that takes in terms of feeling like you don't have the, the medicine you need, having to switch to a new medicine, but also the fact that if it's uh, a widespread issue and this is the one that works for them and works best for them, it could cause some medical issues. Dr. Binks says once you start taking the drug, you're in for the long haul. The whole point of chronic illness is that you don't stop the treatment when symptoms have improved. These are about providing the body with something that it's missing and, and that needs to be replaced long term. And Dr. Childress is hopeful the supply of the drug stabilizes very soon. This medication literally saves lives. That that is what really makes it so important. Are there other medications for diabetes? Yes. Are there other medications for obesity? Yes. But so far, this is one of the best we've seen. And Dr. Childress says insurance coverage for both Ozempic and Wegovy has been spotty for patients, leaving many having to foot a heavy bill. According to GoodRx, the cheapest you can buy Ozempic without insurance is over $900 per month. As for Wegovy, it's at least $1,300.